Hi everybody. This is going to be a short video. Um, it is July 11th, 2021. And welcome. I'm Rajit of One Illumined Heart. So many of you have probably been feeling uh, lots of either physical, mental, or emotional turbulence, we could say, <laughs> in the last few weeks. And in the last few days, it's been really intense. Uh, July 8th through this coming Tuesday, which is, I believe, the July 13th. There's a really intense time of pressure on the planet. As you know, I've talked um, with all of you about the opening of the portals and creating the new 5D grid around the Earth, which started um, last year, uh, April the 25th and 26th, depending on where you were in the world. So now we have have the fifth dimensional grid. So we've got the third dimensional grid, which is full, fully connected, right? The longitudinal and latitudinal lines. Well, now the fifth dimensional grid will be fully connected on July 22nd of this year. So we're just literally inches away of that final connection. So right now we're having this huge planetary effect on that connection and it is it's like it's going like this like zzz. now the higher the frequency spiritual frequency that a person has the higher their crystal body is the more of an impact of changes energetically that are going through our physical bodies to um uh accommodate this new shift in this new direction that we're going it is all wonderful and good because there is greater love, greater light, greater opportunity for all of us to individually grow, to grow um, as a collective. Um, there's such an opportunity for great up-leveling, greater compassion for everyone. And I'm, I'm hoping that all of you will take the time to tune in to your own self, to take the time to do your own meditation your own prayer work your own gratitude so that you can quiet time to accommodate these changes some people are requiring more rest during this time there's also a sense of maybe feeling a little bit more irritable um, whatever it is that you need pay attention because it is very real um, I thank God I have uh, someone who's visiting me for a month and um, she just arrived on the 5th and on Thursday, on the 8th, I literally required help getting myself put together, going into work. I could hardly walk. I was like the hunchback of Notre Dame with my body totally torqued. So I just want you to know that the physical aspect, some people also had said that they feel way more sleepy, need more rest. Other people just felt emotionally disturbed and unsettled. Um, and I think when you've got all these new frequencies coming in onto the planet to unite all of these energies of um, in the grid where everything is going to, you know, hook into each other, there is this incredible pressure that is of all of this coming together. I'm not sure what the big outcome will be on the 22nd of July, but I'm not working that day because <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. So I just want to let you all know to uh, love yourselves and know that this is a, such a grand opportunity for growth and an extension of an also of your heart to be able to extend that to others and to say prayers for the world, um, for the awakening of this possible for every single person to wake up. But you have to be willing to embrace that number one, you are love, that you want to extend love into the world that you want to respect Mother Earth, the water, the air, all of life, and, hum and uh, animals. So uh, one of the things that has been concerning uh, to me with all of this is to remember now with the um, viruses having mutations. Truly, truly, folks, take care of your immune systems. Do what you can to take extra vitamin A, D3, some zinc, uh, vitamin C, and whatever else your doctor would recommend. Um, I 
recommend you look at holistic doctors um, who can, or uh, people who work in that field, uh, perhaps nurses, uh, nutritionists, naturopathic doctors, herbalists, Chin you know, Chinese acupuncturists, etc. They know how to help you get your body strong. And there are natural ways to do this. So you can support yourself by not eating junk food, not too much sugar uh, or none is, is ideal. And then make sure that you um, eat well. Uh, ideally stop eating flesh foods. I'm telling you, I'm watching the people who are eating flesh foods become so much more vulnerable to these viruses, vaccinated or not, both ways. So um, anyway, I, I would just suggest that you, you work on your immune system and talk to your doctor, whatever kind of doctor that you um, are working with, so that you can keep yourself healthy and strong. So just enjoy this new upgrade that we're having energetically with the planet lifting into this higher frequency, giving all of humanity such an amazing opportunity to grow and hold light. So much love to all of you, many blessings, and um, I wish you all lots and lots and lots of love. God bless you and namaste. Take care. Bye-bye.